Uh, obviously, it was a tough night for Mold. Um, but what did you think of the game? Uh, I think we started off badly in the first half. But then in the second half, I think our team improved much. And yeah, I think we played. Uh, sometimes in the second half, we played decent. But then in the end, we were tired and yeah, we lost 6 to 1. So we're not happy about the result. but. We take it as experience and we learn from it. So we will improve next time. Uh, after this defeat, what do you think that can be the future of the, your team in this competition? Uh, no, we'll just, as I said, we will learn from this game and we will see what we can improve. I think we have a sporting at home next Wednesday. So we will definitely be hoping of beating them at home and then we will take one one day at a time one match game at a time uh, i know that that you were an under 19 international from norway um yeah. what's the situation this year uh no the under 19s this year are done because we didn't make it to the european championship so the next step there would be the under 21s and yeah, I'm of course hoping to get there one day in the future, but there's no international football and for me right now. Uh, you are part of the main squad in Molde. Yeah. Uh, have you played the matches, the competitive matches in, in Tipa Tip League only one, only one game, one game. Okay. So hopefully I will play some in the future. Uh, one more question. Um, it was a very dominating performance by Sporting. Uh, were you expecting it to be such a, a tough game for Mold? Uh, yeah, I, I was expecting Sporting to be a good team and a ball possession team. And so I think they will make it far in this tournament. And yeah, they were a good team. So all the best for them in the future.